American Horror Story is slowing down production amid the writer's strike, however, filming on season 12 is still pushing forward for better or for worse. And I've got all of the updates you need to know about the upcoming American Horror Story Delicate. Before we start, I just want to remind y'all to hit that subscribe button for the latest horror content from me. A significant portion of my views recently have been from people who have yet to subscribe, so I thought I'd try a little call to action. This summer, I have multiple videos planned for each month, plus the latest AHS news in my community tab, so subscribe so you don't miss any of that. Now back to the news. If you've tuned into my last two news reports on this season, you know that the confirmed cast members for season 12 are Emma Roberts, Kim Kardashian, Michaela J. Rodriguez, Matt Matt Zucri, Cara Delevingne, and Annabelle Dexter Jones. Speaking of Emma and Kim K, the pair have recently been spotted filming scenes together in New York City on a high rise balcony. Kim has also been photographed holding one of the season's scripts for episode 3, which confirms that the episode will be entitled When the Bow Breaks, and it is written by the season's sole writer Hallie Pfeiffer, and will be directed by Jennifer Lynch, a frequent AHS director of the most recent five seasons. My favorite episode of the ones that Jennifer Lynch has directed would have to be True Killers from AHS 1984. But back to the cast, we also got confirmation that MJ Rodriguez has been gearing up to film scenes for her role in the season as she has been in costume fittings for her AHS debut. While these confirmed cast members are still the only ones we know for certain will take part in American Horror Story Delicate, there have been a lot of casting rumors that have been swirling since my last video. So let's talk about them from most likely to least likely. First up in the rumor mill is Billy Lord who has been listed as a part of the cast on Production Weekly. We've been talking about Production Weekly a lot in these news reports lately and like I keep saying, I do trust them so I am considering her to likely be a part of the ensemble this season. The only thing I'm waiting on to bump her up to confirmed would be an article from a trade like Deadline or The Hollywood Reporter, or if she gets spotted on set at some point. I'm a Billy fan, and I think her inclusion in this season would be great. Not only is she on a streak of five American Horror Story seasons in a row, but how could you deny us another season of television with this duo? Like I said, Production Weekly hasn't done us wrong yet, but for now, let's just wait and see. Next up, let's talk Dennis O'Hare. In the last video, I said we should keep an eye on him because he had to pull out of a horror convention due to filming obligations. With his recent history with American Horror Story, it could easily be for a role in Delicate or maybe even the upcoming third season of American Horror Stories, which is also currently in production. But it also very well could be a completely separate project, so this one's just speculation at this point, so let's just wait and see. Next, Leslie Grossman has been rumored to be involved in American Horror Story Delicate after sharing social media posts in New York City. With her five season streak, I would not be shocked if she made it a six season streak and joined American Horror Story Delicate, but for now, all we know is that this woman just went on a trip or she could be there on separate business, we just need more confirmation to nail her down to this season. I'd love to see another Leslie role, I thought even though her role last season wasn't the biggest, it definitely was one of her most compelling emotionally, along with her iconic run as Margaret Booth in 1984. Again, we'll just have to wait and see if Leslie turns up in any paparazzi photos or press releases. Odessa Azion, who had been rumored to be a part of the season by fan accounts with no disclosed source, is still just that, rumored. In my last video, I stated how MJ Rodriguez sharing this fan edit including Odessa was basically confirming her involvement and I think I got a little too excited because for one, MJ had not begun filming at that point and maybe just took that fan's word for it after seeing a majority of the already confirmed cast in that edit. Just because the initial source of this casting is so flimsy being a fan account not disclosing their source and with the timing of MJ Rodriguez's post, I can't say with confidence that Odessa will be in the season but it's in the universe so who knows, we'll just have to wait and see with this one as well. Well. Lastly, let's talk Demi Moore, who I am classifying as unlikely being involved with American Horror Story Delicate, despite how much it would elevate the cast. Rumors went wild recently after AHS fan accounts began spreading a photo of the actress posing in a mysterious photo shoot, which some claim to be for American Horror Story. Only now, fan accounts claim production sources have said that the shoot was not for American Horror Story. Listen, I haven't seen any of those sources firsthand, but to me this whole thing seems to be a miscommunication 
communication either intentionally orchestrated to fool fans or this promo campaign is actually for a production close to American Horror Story or Ryan Murphy and fans maybe jump to conclusions a little bit. I am definitely leaning towards the latter. I don't think this was intentionally put out there to mislead American Horror Story fans. I think it's a miscommunication because Demi Moore has already filmed season two of Ryan Murphy's Feud anthology series, which this time will be centered around New York City socialites in the 60s. Perhaps they're just now getting around to shooting the promotional campaign for that season, or even maybe working with a similar or the same promotional team that is currently working on either American Horror Story or American Horror Stories. To me, that seems to probably be what's going on here, and it's just a miscommunication. And as much as I'd like Demi Moore to be a part of this season, I do not think that she will be, unfortunately. All right, now with all of the casting news and rumors out of the way, let's talk a little bit more about how the writer's strike is affecting the production and release of American Horror Story Delicate. Production has slowed down recently with the end date for filming being pushed from the original August end date to now October, and FX has also revealed their entire summer broadcast lineup with no sign of American Horror Story, despite previously having announced that the season would come out in the summer. So it seems like these production delays might have pushed the release date back a little, but like I said before, what the Writers Guild is striking for is a worthwhile cause. Writers deserve a living wage, royalties and residuals should be consistent between broadcast and streaming shows, and writer's room should have numerous contributing voices. All of these things just lead to screenwriting being a viable career path for writers as it has been in the past and is no longer. This is exactly what the Writers Guild of America is striking for, along with so many other issues that not only would help current writers be able to maintain a living wage, but it also promotes a healthier environment where more writers are given more opportunities in the industry and in the long run, it would make the television and films that you and I both enjoy that much better. Now, Disney and American Horror Story have been going above and beyond to squash any union solidarity and keep their productions rolling throughout this. Disney, the parent company of FX, sent out a pointed email to its writers, producers, and showrunners stating that they are obligated to work on non-writing duties while still encouraging writers to resign from the WGA and continue writing. The email also makes it clear that Disney will replace anyone who does disrupt productions by striking alongside the Writers Guild, aside from writers because they are protected by the union. The language in this email is very careful yet clear. It's a writer's choice if they want to write during the writer's strike, but producers showrunners and directors must perform their duties or risk being fired if they show solidarity. While the email states that showrunners must only continue work on non-writing duties, to them that includes script revision, which would be violating the strike rules based on my understanding. Disney is not the only studio to have sent out emails like this, as it appears that every studio aside from Netflix and Universal, according to Deadline, have sent out similar emails. Sure, members of other guilds may be barred from striking in solidarity with the writers, but sure Surely, when you're actively encouraging your employees to resign from the guild and continue writing, and producers and directors are being threatened with termination for any acts of solidarity, to me it's just a very expectedly tone-deaf response from executives to a conflict that could easily be resolved in everyone's favor, but instead is being drawn out even longer by these studios doing the most to make sure the strike doesn't interrupt their bags. In another shady move by Disney Productions, including American Horror Story Delicate, it has been alleged that the productions of AHS Delicate and the upcoming Daredevil reboot series, both under the umbrella of Disney, have been sending out fake call sheets to its crew members and then personally calling those crew members individually with an earlier call time in hopes that picketers would believe the physical call sheets and show up picketing long after the actual cast and crew were called in to show up. This alleged information comes from Deadline's podcast Strike Talk, and yeah, it's shady as hell and it's clear that Disney and other major studios are entities that are prioritizing their profits over the livelihoods of their employees. This is nothing new, but it is why the Writers Guild is striking. With their alleged fake call sheets and union-busting parent company, American Horror Story Delicate is still filming in New York City as we speak under the codenames of Hamptons and Thriller. Like I mentioned before, Jennifer Lynch will be directing an episode of the season, and Max Winkler, director of an episode of Double Feature and an episode of NYC, is also 
reportedly returning to direct an episode for Delicate as well. Another rumored director for Delicate is Jessica Yu, who has directed episodes of Ratched, Hollywood, and 13 Reasons Why. And there you have it. There's everything we know about the upcoming 12th season of American Horror Story entitled Delicate. Because of everything becoming even more shrouded in secrecy with the writer's strike, the news coming from set has been significantly slower than in the couple of weeks that the season was in production before the strike. But nonetheless, give this video a like if you liked it, and I will see you next time with more horror content and AHS news.